Yo, what's up guys? So in today's video, I'll show you my updated free tweaking utility. So this tool increases your FPS, decreases your latency and input delay. It also has other benefits like cleaning your temporary files and other useless apps of your PC. But before we start the tutorial, I want to tell you guys about my premium and standard tweaking utilities. So these are basically better and more advanced versions of this free one. They have a lot more tweaks than my free one. So if you notice a difference after the free utility, then my premium or standard tweaking utility will help you so much more. I have hundreds of reviews on my website and my discord server, so make sure to check them out. Now let's just start the video. Alright, so first I'll show you how to download the tool. So simply go to the description of this video and go here and join this discord server you can see. This is discord.gg slash exm so once you're in the server simply go to the free utility category and here you can download the tool uh, so just click on the google drive link and right click on this and press download i should have it downloaded here so just press on this and make sure you're minimized out of everything and just drag it onto your desktop before we get into using the tool i want to tell you guys Get this video to 1,500 likes and I'll drop an updated version of the utility. So yeah, just right click on it and run it as administrator. So here, uh, press any key to continue. And here we can make a restore point. So if you're wondering what a restore point is, it will basically allow you to revert all of the settings back if you need to in case. And I highly recommend doing this. So just press one and I'll skip to when it's finished. All right, so the first thing you want to do is press one and enter on your keyboard. So just do this and uh, here this will pop up this menu and uh, do every single option in here. All right, so first we have general performance tweaks. So just press one and enter. And this is how the whole thing will, will work. So you're just going to press all of the numbers followed by enter. And it may take a little while to complete the tweaks, but I don't want to waste your guys' time. And I'll just skip to when I'm finished with this category there will be a lot more stuff which I'll need to explain in the rest of the video, so yeah. All right, so after that we have power tweaks and in power tweaks, if you're on a PC which has overheating issues, then don't do them. So just press okay on this pop-up, press one and enter. And here it will apply my power plan, which this is one of the best free power plans out there and I highly recommend using it over stuff like ultimate performance, but I'm still gonna use my premium power plan since it's better. But yeah, uh, then just press two and then we'll do power tweaks. So before we get into the next category, I wanna tell you guys, uh, if you want to revert some stuff without having to use a restore point, just press E. And here you can bring back default power plans and stuff like that. So yeah, uh, I'm just gonna go to three. And here I'm gonna do the first five options since there isn't really anything to explain about them. And then we have disable useless animations, which is press six. This will open this little menu and make sure you copy my settings. So make sure show thumbnails instead of screen icons and smooth edges on screen fonts are checked. And just press apply and okay. So after that, we have disable Bluetooth, which most of this is pretty self-explanatory. And then we have Windows Update Blocker, which this will allow you to block Windows updates from randomly starting up in the background. The here, you can enable them back anytime. But uh, sometimes when you're playing a game and a Windows update starts, it will completely kill your performance. So that's why I recommend having them disabled. And if you want to actually install one, just go open the app and enable them. And also as a little side note, if you have them disabled, then Microsoft Store is broken. So if you want to enable Microsoft Store, just enable updates as well. After that, we have disable Cortana, which is disabling another useless feature. And I'm just gonna speed run through the rest of the six options since there isn't really anything to explain. So then we have RAM tweaks, so just press five and enter. So yeah, after RAM tweaks, we have the Autoruns app, which this is a really useful app and it will allow you to disable a bunch of startup services. So here, make sure you go to log on. So just go to log on right here and basically, Make sure everything except your antivirus. So this is my antivirus, then CMD and these NA files should be checked and the rest should be unchecked. Stuff like Discord, Epic Games Launcher and simply just close the application after you're finished. All right, so after that we have GPU tweaks. So just press seven, enter. And here you can select whichever type of GPU you have and just do the respective tweak. So if you have Nvidia GPU, just press one and so on so on so if you don't know what type of gpu you have just press t and enter so open task manager go to this performance section 
and then go to GPU and you can see I have a NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3080. The GPU, press one, enter. If you have an NVIDIA GPU and if it shows like Radeon or something, then press two, so on, so on. And uh, yeah, so that's finished. So then we have CPU tweaks, so just press eight and enter. And after that, we have USB tweaks, pretty self-explanatory. All right, so after that, we have mouse and keyboard tweaks, so just press uh, 10. And here, uh, this will do a bunch of settings, and then it will open this menu. So, it should open any second. Okay, so here is the menu, and here you basically select whichever type of CPU you have. And I'll tell you how to find this out. So, just press T, this will open Task Manager, go to Performance. And basically comment whatever is right here and I'll tell you whichever one of the options you have to use. So my CPU is a high-end one, so I'm just going to select that. Alright, so that's everything for utility. In order for the tweaks to work, uh, you have to restart your PC and then you can test it out on your favorite games. And if this video helped you, comment below so people know it's legit. And before you click off, I'm gonna tell you guys about a way where you can completely optimize your PC for the best possible FPS, lowest possible delay and latency, and also lower ping. So in the utility, simply press W or just search up exmtweaks.com on Google. And these are my tools, which are basically better versions of this free one. Basically, the free v version is just a watered down version of premium. And trust me, if the free version helped you, then especially by premium utility, this will completely change your gameplay and make you a lot better. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching, thank you so much for the recent support, sorry for not uploading that much, I've been really busy, and I'm also working on some different type of content, uh, I'm gonna make a video about 25 FPS boost tips and stuff like that, something different than the tweaking utility, so you know, I'm just cooking some stuff, love you, bye!